Well, hi everyone. This is Janice. Uh, today I'm going to do a get ready with me. I'm going to use some new products I bought and I thought I'd share them with you and give you my thoughts. So if that sounds interesting to you, please keep watching. I just have my skincare on. I received a product in my lower box and I just upload that video so it's um, the unboxings in that video but this is it here I'm going to put my glasses on it's called French Girl and it's a love floor and it's plant essence it's a botanical serum and I thought I'd give it a try and it really makes my face feel nice all I did was cleanse my face um, and then put this on. I haven't put anything else on yet. Don't know that I will because it's really nice and hydrating. So I think I'm gonna just leave that on there because I want to use this. I received, I ordered this. This is Danessa Merritt's. It's her balm. And I've been playing around with it. I'm going to use it as a primer today. Still kind of learning about the product. I really like it so far. I've used the bombs before and liked them, so I thought I'd give this one a try. And I got the color. They do come in colors. They come in translucent, and then they have a separate of different colors. I got the, well this is called the Yummy Skin, and I got the number three. And the number three was like a, a light, light medium, I believe. So, but with that, that's usually what I wear in foundation, so use that. So just need a little bit. Okay. And just warm it up and just massage it on your skin. I use my fingers. And what this does is just blurs your skin takes out some of the texture and imperfections, pores, and I just press it in. So that's how it looks. And I've got my 10x beer. I'm still learning, so I want to see how it looks. Yeah, just smooths out my complexion. Okay. I'm going to let that set for a few minutes. I also ordered the new palette she has. I saw this and I thought, oh my gosh, I already have it. Called the Light Work, called the Light Work Volume 4 Translucent Palette. Eliminating eye face pigments and it's beautiful packaging. It's a nice size palette. It comes with a nice big mirror and like a little thin piece of foam. What you call that? <laughs> and then overlay of um, a plastic sheet. Now there is, I believe, three different formulas in this. There's a velvet chromes, aqua chromes, and pressed chrome flakes. Now this is all new to me. I've not used any of these formulas. Here I am, gonna do a get ready with me. I'm not sure what to do. But uh, I'm gonna learn, I'm just gonna try it. And that's that. I'll show you the colors real quick. Aren't they beautiful? And most of these are duochrome and um, multi-chrome. We've got Trance, Nirvana, Divinity, Sixth Sense, 
and out of body. Those are all the set it in my velvet crumbs. Oh, I take that back. There's a glass metallic in here. There's two of them. This is the glass metallic, this one here. And the other glass metallic is um, this white one down here. And that white one is called Angels. So I guess there's four from this. I told you I was just learning about this. I read up on it. I just seen the palette and had to have it. I got to do Beauty Lish. She does have a website also. But, uh, I just seen it through Beauty Lish and I ordered it. Her website, I could have got 15% off. Oh, well, I have ordered from her before. That's what, well, obviously, I got this. And also, I got the um, gel laundry crumbs, which I haven't yet showed you. I got those probably several months ago. And I haven't really played with them that much. I think I have a couple times and worn them. But they're upstairs in my other room. So I'm just going to play with this today. Okay, back to what I was saying. The bottom is Zen Angels again. And Trippy. Escapon An Awakening and this and Intuition and Aurora now those are the Aqua Chromes then we got the two press chrome flakes in the middle and this Heaven in Paradise okay now um, the Aqua Chromes, you have to use water to activate them. And I, I did, you know, watch some videos on it and watched her video. And it looked easy. So I don't know if I need a base. You know, I'm going to put a base on in first, anyways. But what I'm going to do is kind of put that on hold for a minute finish my face. Okay. okay. Next thing I was going to put on to show you is I got the Jones Road with the foundation and I got it in light. I wanted to try this. It's basically for those who like the no makeup look. So I don't know how this is going to transfer on film because sometimes I like to use a hair foundation when I film but I'm just gonna use this and hope for the best. I did use it yesterday in the video I made on the last part of the video. I think I talked about it briefly on that video. Okay, Jones's room. This is the jar. This is the lid. Now you can either Put this on with your fingers, a brush, or a sponge. Now yesterday I put it on with my fingers. So do I want to try a brush this time? Just to see? Um, yeah, I think I will. Let's see what I have here. Oh, I also, this is like a haul video too. It's an all-in-one video. I ordered uh, some cow pop. I ordered the 12, 12 brushes. Huh? Anyway, these, these are the um, Stone Cold collection. I had gotten a brush from them in one of my mystery bags. I was very impressed with the brush. And I seen this and I thought, you know, that's a very good value for you what I paid for it. I know I got the palette, which was a Stone Cold. Oh, yeah, let me go get that for you. I'll show you real quick. This video is going to be long, so it's just off a snack and a drink. In fact, I might use this as a base color, one of these. So I've always wanted this palette. It's been out for quite some time. It's all cool tones, and I love cool tones on me. I'm not that crazy about warm tones. I wear them occasionally. I love the cool tones. And it's a cardboard palette. 
and dark glue dots. So this has been on a while, so I'm sure you've seen it. I'm not gonna swatch it or anything, but uh, I love these colors. So anyway, the brush palette is companion to, to this. The brushes are a companion to this palette. So I thought I mentioned that. All right, let's find a brush for my face. I haven't really looked at them yet. Let's see if I find the foundation one. Kind of looks like a foundation. This one is, but I won't use this for foundation. I use this for something else. Oh my goodness, I can't get out of the plastic. Okay, good. Oh, well, it could be for blush too. See the kind of foundation brush I'm looking for. Well, I really don't need one in that one because this is the brush I wanted. This is the one I got through ColourPop's mystery bag a couple months ago. And this is what I want to use. I'm going to use it. It applies nice with my fingers, so this is an experiment how I like with my brush. You don't need a lot, I do know that. So I'm just gonna Fill it on and start blending. This is really nice. It smells good. It's got a nice fresh herbal scent, but uh, once you get on your face, you don't really smell it. it. Smells real healthy and clean, and they say it is a clean makeup, a healthy makeup. Which I'm still learning about that. <laughs> All right, I don't need much, so I don't want to overdo it. Let's see how this looks on the face. Looking at my mirror. So my viewfinder is a ways off there. I'm using my little camera viewfinder, so that's even smaller. Okay, that's it. I'll go ahead and kind of press it in my fingers. Does feel real balmy and very hydrating. I didn't even, I didn't need much, see? Not at all. I mean, I'm still working on what was in the top, and I've used this maybe four times now. I've yet to dip into the pot. <laughs> I think I'm really liking this foundation. Well, they say not to put on your neck, but I'm gonna have to do it now, so it's okay. Because it, it sinks in your skin. There's no, there's no difference. You don't see no line, so you don't need to blend it into your neck. That's why they say that. And it does just melt into your skin. Now, when I've worn it before, it's tacky right now. But when I worn it before, after a while, it stops being so tacky. I don't so I forget how long it takes, but not that awfully long. I also bought the Jones Road Balm. I thought it'd be like the other balm, the Danessa Matrix, and it really wasn't, so I went in and ordered this. It's different. And I watched quite a few videos on this. I'm still a little confused about it, but I wanted to try it. And I got this tawny. Okay. Now the reason why I got this shade is so I can use it for a little more color in my face, bronzing, things like that. They have it in all different colors. And what you do, you warm it up your finger. First of all, you push in 
kind of break that seal. Okay. <laughs> it's, it's weird. And then you just kind of let it melt into your finger while you're pushing and swirling on it. I hope you're telling me right. This is what I've been doing. And then you get a little bit of your finger. What I do is just give myself some color. And you don't need much. Thank you that much. I'm still not afraid to use it, but still careful how to use it. I don't know why. I don't I get nervous with new things that I'm gonna think about. Give myself a little color here. On my cheeks. Down in here. And you can use this all over your face actually. But you see, even though it looks so dark in that uh, dish here, it, it doesn't. It just gives me a little bit of a bronzy glow, if you can tell. Hope you can tell. And, uh, and I could probably put more on. But I don't want to overdo it. Here we go. One day I need to sit here and just go crazy and play with this stuff. I'm not filming. You can even put it on your lips. Yeah. It's a bomb. I didn't put it on my neck. I just kind of blending. Okay. So that did give me a little color. Okay, that is the Jones Rose. Oh, yes, I did. Get this. I do with it. But you will, yeah, I got one of their pencils because this is for like spot. This this is not full coverage. I would say it's light coverage, definitely. But if you have a lot of spots, you can take this pencil. They have different colors. I got this one. It's, it's like a light medium. And to cover up any spots. I don't have a whole lot. Just a little couple, and you just cover them up. Okay. You really see them, you think, why do I like this? I don't really have any spots. Over here, I got a scar. When I was a baby, my brother threw a metal truck at me. <laughs> That's way back in the 50s when they had those kinds of toys. I got my brothers. He's still living with me. He's doing great. So, he can hear you now. So, working out good. He has COPD. If I, if you haven't watched all my videos, he's, and I'm, he's staying with my husband and I, and we're um, helping him out, taking care of him. And, um, yeah, so he's, he's happy. So, he's doing good. Even though he's, he was mean to me when I was a kid. I don't think he was mean. He was just being a boy. And I don't remember. I was so young. I have no memory of, of that. I just laugh about it when he tells me about it because he still remembers that. And he, he says, You know what I did? I threw a truck at you and you had a big scar. There's blood running down your face. But my mom got after him. <laughs> yeah. All right. Now, I'm just going to take, and it's a little dirty, but it's only been used once. But I'm going to go ahead and just press this in just because I'm still playing a bit, playing with it, making sure I like the way it turns out at the end. Now they say you can put other makeup on over this, powder, whatever you want. Um, I'm sure you can wear other foundation under it if you want. Why not? 
I don't because I don't like a lot of stuff on my face. Yeah, I know. I'm on my neck again. <laughs> What's next? Oh, yeah. I um, went to Walmart and I picked a couple of products up because I wanted to try it. I was going to order it on their e.l.f. website. I said, I went to Walmart and they had it. So, ah, don't need to order it. Safe shipping. I got an e.l.f. putty blush. And that's a pink. What color pink are you? Oh, I threw the box away. I have no idea. I mean, it's a pink. And I got a putty bronzer. This was the tan one. I do remember that. I think that was, I'm pretty sure that was called pink. I don't remember. So I used this a couple times and liked it. I'm gonna go ahead and use my, I use this brush as a cream blush applicator. It's new. <laughs> Take off my glasses. This is one bigger about wearing glasses. They're on and off all the time. I don't really need to wear them to do makeup. I don't need to wear them to watch TV or walk around the house or walk drive because I have cataract surgery. But when I do close up things, I need to wear them. I like this putty brush. I like it a lot. I gotta get it warmed up because it's so new. There we go. Give some color here. Sign my nose. This big old fat nose my dad gave me. <laughs> so how's everyone? You been getting some new makeup? I know a lot, a lot of things are coming out and new and very exciting. It's that time of year. Holidays are very new. That's all. They all come up with their new stuff. Their clothes all on my money. I have lots of makeup, but I still, when I have this channel, I want to try to get new things out and tell you what I think of them. I want to make sure that I'm a good influence. Not, I'm not an influencer, but good creator to tell you how things work on my mature face. And if you don't know, I, I'm mature obviously I'm 72 have very dry skin I have wrinkles um, my pores aren't too big um, I have a little bit of texture um, quite fortunate that my skin isn't real bad but thanks to genetics but it is quite dry I live in a climate where we have all four seasons so it goes to changes through each season you know, I'm at the blush one. I'm gonna go grab my. I think I'll grab a new one to show them one of my dirty brushes. I have a favorite blush brush. But I think I need to wash that one. I'm sure I can find one here that I like. Yeah, let's go with this one. Why these are so soft? I love them. I'm gonna smile nice and high, make my blush nice and high, kind of lift my face. This is what I do. I am not a makeup artist by no way, shape, or form, but this is what I like to do for me. But if you would like to take some notes and try it for you, feel free to. And if it doesn't, there's that's okay. Everybody's different. So this is nice. I like rubbing across my nose. It gives me more, more life in my skin. It seems like when we get older, we start to get more sallow looking. We always look tired. I think most of the time we are, but we don't want to look it. All right. I think I'm not going to go crazy. 
Sometimes I add powder afterwards. We'll see. Now if I'm just doing this around the home, I wouldn't be doing the video one with nice, so I may put a little powder just to set it. Well, what is next, girl? Oh yeah. I bought a new eyelash curler finally. I've been needing it. This is by Japanese. I think I'm pronouncing that right. And I'm loving it. Got this at Walmart. I think it's only like $89, which isn't bad. My other one I've had for a few years. And it worked good. I thought, you know, I'm going to try a new one. Boy, this looks so much better. I'm warming it up on my fingers. So, it's a nice shape. It fits my eye perfect. My eyelashes still curl from yesterday using this. Look at that. Tell. Just kind of pump it a few times, not too hard, you no. Know, just enough to kind of get a good curl on there. And this eye has less, less eyelashes than this side. It's hereditary. All the ladies in our family, that's how our eyelashes are. But I still have a lot of eyelashes. I've always been blessed with thick eyebrows and thick lashes and long lashes. And when I was younger, I had nice big eyes. They're still good size, but they're getting droopy. What else is not getting droopy on my body? Let's do it one more time, just quick measure. I just did that first to get it out of the way. I usually don't curl my eyelashes till after I put my makeup on, but I'm still contemplating what I want to do with the eye makeup. I'm so scared. It's very intimidating for me. Um, but I have faith in myself. I'll get it. I'm gonna use my good old elf eye primer, which they don't make anymore. I thought, why did they stop it? I love it. It actually dried out. And I bought some of those drops from Inklot. Or did I put... No, you know, I think I did. This one, I didn't do that with this one. I used, I bought this um, multi-purpose solution for contacts. And it softened it up. It was hard. So it softened it back up. Simple trick. Works on a lot of cream products most. It doesn't work on the Super Shocks. Um, shadows from ColourPop. Those dry up, you have to use the ink. Okay. Which, I um, got a couple I have to fix. So we're just gonna go ahead and put that on. I don't know why they stop using this. Why? Why? They also stopped making the powder you used to use underneath your eyes for setting them. You know, I haven't bought that stuff. I still have a little bit left. That should be good. You can use Max paint pots too. They do still have those. Like my Max paint pot, did I? We wet you. Yeah. Right. I use this one because I'm doing elf. I am going to use a base color with my Stone Cold Fox Color Pop palette. I don't know if I have to or not. I don't think it's any of yours what you do, but I'm just going to, and I hope I don't mess it up. Just a neutral mat. I don't know why like, I have to do that. I just, I am. Um, I brushed that because they had nice, a lot of nice eye brushes. Yeah, I have a lot of them, but they're not all that nice. So I'm going to use just the basic neutral here for the color of my skin. Okay, I 
Pan. Now I see girls do two different colors. Well, I enjoy. But I gotta get used to this palette before I do something like that. So we're just gonna do the one look. And it'll be any mini money mo. No one for you yet. Alright. Just gonna pat a little bit on and a little bit more in the crease. Tell you what, these are nice shadows. I'm so happy I bit the bullet and ordered them. Plus, I got them way cheaper. All right, did I get it almost half off? Pretty darn close. I don't know why I didn't remember, but it was a big discount. Enough for me to hit that order. No, order in, as I said. Bye. I, I've been in a buying streak lately. Boy, I had to calm down. It was my birthday and I got a bunch of money and yeah, I spent it. That's something. Um, I gotta quit. I gotta quit. Um, yeah. <sighs> okay, we're gonna do something easy because I'm not gonna mess with aqua ones right now. I gotta do that off camera before I show you. So we're I got blue on. Ah, let's do this color. I'm gonna do awakening. Right here. Okay. And I think they said you can do it with a brush. I'm pretty sure they said they could. Yeah. Anyway, that's what I'm doing. We'll find out. First case scenario, I use my fingers. Um, I know they have a silicone brush set. I'm over here messing with my stuff, sorry. <laughs> and they're out. I would love to get that because it's supposed to be really easy to put these on with a silicone brush. I might even have a couple. But, um, I don't know how small they are. Oh, look what I bought. Never do Elf had this. A little tin with um, the switch. Clean your brushes. Three bucks at Walmart. Yeah, make a lot of things. Like I'm, I'm on my desk here. In my beauty, or in my beauty room, my filming room, I have a, a rug on my desk so I don't make all that noise, but not here. Why oh, these are pretty? I wonder. Let me just swatch what I'm gonna do here. Wow, barely touched it. Just so I see what comes. Can you see that? Um, I can never see these. I will on camera. But it's just some purple to blue to lavender. To great. That looks like a Maldry chrome for sure. Wow, pretty, pretty, pretty. I hope it comes out okay. We're just going to pat it on. I get a little more now. <laughs> I'm being very frugal. Oh, there's the colors. Oh, yes. Um, oh, 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 oh. I don't know if you can see. It's purple here to me and blue. And then turn it more, turn that way, more purple it is. Can you see that? I'm going to bring this up close so I can see. It a little better. Oh my gosh, it's pretty. And I didn't use that much, guys. I could use more, and I will use more. I'm gonna get brave, but I'm trying to keep it conservative. Okay. <laughs> you know me, I will use color. I don't care. I go places and I get compliments. Um, no one thinks it's weird that an old woman's wearing colors. But, uh, and if they did, I don't care. I don't care anymore. At this age, you stop caring about things like that. I mean, you don't want to, I mean, yeah, I'll be a clone sometimes. I don't want to, I don't want to embarrass people. But, uh, no, I'm quite known for my colorful personality. 
and go to different places, like doctor's offices and things, they know me. And they just get a giggle out of it, you know. I think it's cute. I can get away with it because I look cute. <laughs> One thing about being short, you, you, can get, you can get away with more things because you just look cute. <laughs> All my life I've been that way. I can get away with stuff. Yeah, and I do. <laughs> Wow, that's pretty. And then we use that, that, um, what was that one? Dust, diamond dust, what's it called? I'm gonna use Angel. And here is a little teeny tiny brush. Mm -hmm. That's nice. Now this little teeny tiny brush. I should unwrap these before I started. The glass metallics. Okay, I'm gonna use the glass metallic and angel. That's that white here. And I'm going to put it in the inner corner. I'm gonna try this little brush first and see how it goes on. I need to rewatch a few more videos. Do I have which side can I put? Ooh, ah. Nah, I don't need no darn finger. Close. That goes on. That goes on easy. With the brush. I'm just patting it. Yeah. Okay. I want to get experimental and do some of those lines and things. Um, see something that would work for me because as you can tell I still have my big eyes hope I never lose them yeah I have a little bit of fold here and if I ever had the money I might get away with but then again thinking oh why it's expensive some of those fillets let me use I, I'm sure I use my finger for that one I'm gonna use these here. Just to see what happens. I mean, I want to just use two things. You have to push on on it. Okay, let's see here. Just tap it. Oh yeah, it gets wet as you move your finger around in there. Hmm. I'm not sure. Am I doing this right? Let's see, it's on my finger. Oh, there I go. Just had to push it a little harder. A little fun. My eyes are not that delicate. Oh, this is. Oh, it almost feels like putty. I really changed it up, didn't it? I'm gonna go back to this one. You know what? Let's use this color. Why should go for the craziness? This one up here. And that is the twins. And Purple. That's the one I could do will come. Well, I don't know why I did that. I'm going to use my, use my brush. There we go. I hope you ladies enjoy this type of content. I am trying to change my channel a bit and be a little more informative and have you learn along with me because uh, our age, I never, I never 
didn't use any of these things my whole entire life. Didn't know anything about these. So I don't want to be stuck in the old times. I want to learn about the new products. I want to stay current. And that's why I do this. Okay, that one I believe is dual chrome, if I'm not mistaken. Um, oh, I ordered something from Kaleidos. I really get into these multi -pros. And I ordered a multi chrome pencil, so that comes in a few days. That's what I need right now. I don't have one, so I'm just going to hide one of these colors. What color should I use? How about this one? May not match it, may match it. I don't need to. Six cents. It is this one. It looks really pretty. It's a green. And I think it's going to be a. Like, I don't know what I'm going to do. Yeah, I thought so. Like a green and a red shift. See that? Goodness, watch it on my wrist. Yeah, it's green and red. It's a pretty light green. Let me do this trance I just did. So maybe that'll come on my wrist better. See, I think that one is dual chrome. There's just nothing wrong with that. Um, I'm gonna get a light. They come off real nice on your fingers. Not making a mess at all. Which is nice. I use these um, Ipsy refreshments. Um, toilets, cleansing face wipes. I really like them. I, I subscribe to the refreshments and get certain products every few months. I just let them know when I want it. And I've liked everything that I received. Okay. What was I going to do? Oh. I was going to show you the angels that I have on. It's really pretty. That looks like a gold reflex. Yeah. Okay. And now I was going to put on the six cents. Just kind of see how that works on my eyes. I know it's getting crazy, but I'm just trying all these colors out. Close to my mirror so I can see. A little bit of fallout. Uh, I forgot to put powder on, but not a lot. Not as much as I thought. I forgot to powder my under eyes. You know what I forgot to do? I forgot to use under concealer, but um, I'm, not, I'm using it. Elizabeth Arden powder. I love this powder. I heard they may be coming back and popular again. I used I bought this at TJ Maxx. And it used to be like a department store brand. I think, don't quote me, I think Revlon owns it. And I heard they're trying to come back. Um I like their products. I like their powder. It doesn't smell like old ladies either. <laughs> I was going by the store the other day. Where was I? I, I think I was, oh yeah, I was in Walmart. And they're going by and smelling different things. And I said, oh, that smells like in the grandma's. You know, I looked at them and went, so what's wrong with grandma? I <laughs> said, she smells good. <laughs> they laughed. Why do we get blamed for the smells the young girls don't like? Oh my gosh, I met my grandma and my mom smelling wonderful. I don't get it. Oh well, someday when they get older, 
They're gonna wish they smoked the grandma again. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so watch what you say, young ladies, if you're listening. All right, I'm gonna stop here. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and finish up my eyes real quick. And uh, I'll pop back on, because this is getting long. So this is my final look. I went ahead and added on some powder just a little bit and uh, mascara. I did use that new mascara again. I used it yesterday in my video. It's the um, L'Oreal Luminous um, Gel Formula. And I'm really enjoying it. And it's the brush. It's formula is like really like gel. And that's all I use. I use two or three mascaras, just that one. I didn't do any eyeliner. Didn't really think I needed it with all this color. And a little lipstick. I used um, Maybelline Superstay Ink Crayon. And it's the color. What color are you? Oh, I don't know. It's just numbers. Maybe that's the color. This does have a little sharpener at the end. And this is the color. This is a fairly new purchase also at the drugstore. And I really like it. Thought I'd give myself just a pale pink look. But into pink lips it's good. Kind of go through faces. And I'm liking this one. Don't need a lip liner with this one, so that's nice. And just kind of shave my eyebrows a bit with the, um, what are you, Maybelline Total Depression. I don't even know if they sell this one anymore, but I've had it for a while and I use it and I like it. What else did I use? Oh yeah, I got this one of my boxes, um, the Glowing Palette by Oakland. I believe I got it in my Slade Glam bag and I use these two colors here. And I used to do it a little bit. Let me show you. I didn't use very much. I should put more on. I can't really see it. Sometimes I'm afraid to put too much highlighter on. Oh, and I I guess this is also a blush palette. But it's an illuminating one. But uh, this one here, I actually like for a uh, topper of my blush. It's this one. It's pretty. I just think it brings out my complexion. I'm not using my studio lights today. I'm just using my craft lights, which are like D lights. So I hope this is showing up okay. I didn't feel like going to my studio. I just wanted to do it here at my desk, my beauty desk. And so that's the total look. So I hope you enjoyed today's video and got something out of it. And if you did, I'd love it if you would subscribe if you haven't already. Give me a like if you like this video. And also, um, hit that notification bell so you will be notified when I upload a video. And comment. What do you think? Do you think I can pull this look off? I think I need to play with it a little more, which I definitely do think I need to. <laughs> Also share this video. I think that's all it that is. It's about time that we just have fun with our lives and Just go for it and do what makes us feel happy So with all that ladies and gentlemen please Stay well stay safe and Happy and I'll see you in my next video. Bye